let's go to our home world. We have more solstice shrines to do. Two more, in fact. Well, you know, now that we can fly. Ah, oh, so cool. Let's head to, well, let's finish. Let's do the solstice shrines. That's what we can do. Sleeper Island has a treasure left in the port town of Brisk. Treasure left. Okay, so let's go to, let's go to this solstice shrine first. It's the closest one. Boom, baby. Whoop. Let's see what we got. Solstice shrine. The one by Mirth. Okay. Well, that was easy. <laughs> Nail nailed that one. Oh, another. Wait, are these all? These are just to get inside. Oh, okay. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. So we do this one first. Oh, I think we actually have to... Oh, whoa. Well, this is just really cool. All right, that's the one that activates that. Is there anything else we can do while we're... I don't think so. Oh, maybe we could actually do... Maybe we could do... Hang on. Yeah, and then we can use, so we can come up here. Ah. So then we can jump up here. And then we can do this light. Perfect. Oh, this is cool. This is actually really neat. So we can grab this one first, I think. Put a block out there for us. And we can go on this. Uh, no, we can't. Well, maybe we could. Oh, I think we just... Okay, so we can come over here if we wanted to. I don't see any reason to right now, though. So I think we just jump... We use this to get down. Yeah, yeah. So we just go across. We can flip this one. And then we can go up here. Drop down here. Flip this switch. Nice. And then we can... Now we can get back over there by going this way, doing this. Wait, what we need... Ah. Huh. Can we, like... Okay, maybe... Maybe we can now do something... With that block? Ah, there we go. Nice. Now we can do that. This is the coolest solstice shrine so far. I actually really like this one. The puzzle's fun, but also the... Like, the puzzle's fun, but, like, it's also outside, and that's new. Heliacal earrings. One more Solstice Shrine remains. We'll do... Let's see what that is. Sunball does full damage to... Are you forking kidding me? Are you serious? Are you serious? Done. 
Sunball does full damage to Splash. That is absurdly strong. Oh my gosh, we're the best. We're gonna be, we're so good. We're gonna be the, wow. Okay, cool. Oh, yeah, dude. I can't, we use abeyance from Rashawn. We boost, we win. That's incredible. That's good stuff, dude. Oh, geez, how are we gonna leave this? Oh, wait, I can turn into a, the damn sun, sort of. Woo! That is that is wildly good. Okay, uh, that that's not the solstice shrine. Right? Oh, that's where he that was where he was pointing for us to go though. In sunken Dakari ruins. Huh. Well, we'll find out after, of course, we tackle this, the last solstice shrine. Well, sort of. And then we have, of course... Oh, didn't mean to do that. And then, of course, we have the trial, so... Solstice Shrine. Well, this one doesn't seem too bad. I think we just do... We do the bigger ones first. Oh, yeah. Beautiful. Let's go in. Very few rainbow conches remain, by the way. Okay, so we have like a... Let's turn on some lights first. Oh, oh, don't jump down. Oh, shoot. Don't jump down. <laughs> huh. So we jump here. Oh, we need to move it over to the platform. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Okay, hang on. So we hit this one. That's not quite what I wanted to do. Oh, maybe it is. Oh, no, I didn't mean to do that. Uh, I need a back. I need a back one. I need to... No, I don't want to do that. Okay, well, that's not quite where I wanted to go. All right, so we'll hit... We'll hit... Uh, we'll go... We'll do... We'll do this one. See, that's what I meant to do. I told you, dear viewer... See, obviously, I meant to hit that so that we can open one of the lights, and then obviously we have to get to the other side, too. So we'll just jump off. Easy. I told you. This is easy peasy. And then we'll hit this, and it'll reset the puzzle. All right, dope. So can we jump onto this one? Oh, no, I don't want it. Why does it? Oh, my. oh I, I see why. And then we hit this, and we just jump off okay it's if you if you go at all it'll do it well this puzzle is the this is probably the easiest one we've done so far to be honest with you and we might not even need to reset might be able to just do this yep uh yeah because we can't nice yeah, that was the easiest so far. We get Eclipse Armor. And that is the last Solstice Shrine we can do. Meaning we now have access to... Wait, that is not what I expected that to be. Excuse me? Anyways, we do have armor now. The Eclipse Armor. The Solstice Warrior's Ultimate Protection. Plus 10 defense, plus 13 magic defense. Uh, what about you? All right, we'll give it to Zale. Zale's stats are all over 100 now. Holy oh, baby. All right, that's it. We're done here. I don't think there was any other things we could get, so... Wow, dude. Wow. 
I hope we get another Eclipse Armor for our girl Valir, but we're not done yet because now that unlocked something with the Elder Mist, which was, what was the fastest way to that trial? I think it was right below where the Elder Mist actually was, so I think we just go like here-ish. The Mountain Trial. Mountain Trail. That's what I said. All right. Can't I just fly here? <laughs> Thank you. I don't need none of these platforms now. Still standing on them for no reason. All right. So it's not here. It's down. We go down here. And it was underneath the area. Yep, right there. Let's, uh, let me see if there's a save, actually, before we do anything. Yeah, if we come up here, we can save the game real quick, which I definitely think we should. And you know what? For funsies, why don't we do it again? Same thing we did for the... the gun goddess. We'll do Artful Gambit, and we'll do Double Edge again, and just in case... We'll do six cents as well. We don't really, like I said, we don't need to do that. The six cents one, but it's a 35% chance. It's just like a little bit safety, so you don't have to keep resetting if you mess up a timing, you know? But, you know, bragging rights, do it without it, for sure. I knew it. It's going to be a boss. We're going to have to fight Elder Mist again. Solon and Luana. You have come a long way on this journey. Weapons of great power have manifested in the dream world. Prove yourselves worthy and claim them as your own. Yeah. This challenge is for the two of you alone. Are you ready to face me one last time? Yeah. Wait, just the two of us though. Then close your eyes. Let's go. We're gods. We can do this. Oh my god, this is so cool. Okay. Elder Mist. Just the two of us versus the Elder Mist. We're going to go ahead and start off right away with a big old strong sunball from Zale right at the sword. It's going to do no damage to Elder Mist, but it is going to do a ton towards that 800 health sword that we have to take out. Uh, let's go ahead and use Crescent Arc here from Valir, just so that we can get a little bit more breakage on that lock here, and then a big dash strike to finish that off with Zale. So, already using a lot of MP right out of the gate, but that's okay, because we want to get this sword down as soon as possible. So, it's going to counter and... Okay, I missed the block, but that did very little damage. I'm happy about that. Now, we could use Solstice Strike, which wouldn't be the worst idea for MP, but I think at this point, we're going to go ahead and use a big Moon Ring, and hopefully, that will allow us to finish off the sword and do some damage to Elder Mist himself while he doesn't have a lock active. Hundred and eighty-five. I don't think that's gonna be enough, and it wasn't. Okay, we got that sword. Does nothing. Okay, I would still break it because it does. You know, it still does a bit. We can just go ahead and normal attack now and get this out, and we also will be able to get a boost started. That's gonna be incredibly important as we go. Uh, could lunar shields here, but I think another moonerang while he's taking damage is probably for the best. We're also, you know, building up our ultimate meter and combo meters as we proceed. Let's hope for a big one from Valir here. Two hundred and twenty damage. That seems low. Oh God. Oh my gosh. That is a one-hit KO if I miss the block timing on that. Uh, Solstice Strike wouldn't do too much here. Um, we're not going to be able to break this lock. There's no way. So I yeah, might as well just use that so that we can get the ultimate meter filled up just a bit. Torbledo. I don't know. Oh, okay. Oh, my gosh. Well, what is the timing on them? We'll get there. Torbledo. That move it hurts. I have no healing items either. My gosh. All right, let's go ahead. Let's just try it. We're going to use Valir. 
Hope for a big Moonerang. Something about this boss, too, is if you see that he has an attack coming up, but there's no lock and his fist is just sitting there, that means he's about to do the hammer down when he, like, punches you. It is a one-shot if you miss the block with the relics that we have equipped, so... 382, that's much better. All right, all right. Oh, my gosh. No pressure. And unfortunately, we have no MP for a Moonerang. I'll just go ahead and eat the gourmet burger just for a bit. Okay, that gave me just enough to be able to Moonerang. Now, at this point, I think he would either... The boss would either use Healing Mist or Thunder based on this lock, but it won't matter for us. We'll go ahead and break it. Two sixty-four, not as good as the previous one. Swords already back, only at four hundred and eighty-nine health though, so that's not too bad. Uh, we do have two combo points here. I think we should just use Sunarang. Now, if you're not using these relics, I do recommend just saving your combo points for Mending Light because Mending Light is an incredibly powerful ability. But with these relics, we're gonna go on the offensive here. Hope that we get some big damage. 279, 297 on the boss himself, and that's the counter slash again. It only does one damage. It scares me, though. Perfect time to use Luana's Might Retribution. Let's go! Oh, oh my gosh. I, like, last second saw that. Unfortunately, I don't have Solstice Strike available, but this would be the perfect time for it. Maybe it's worth holding on to Solstice Strike just to be able to break these locks? Yeah, that's Healing Mist. He'll be... If he has two locks gone, he'll heal for 140. If there's only one, which it looks like this is going to be the situation now, he'll heal for 175, I believe? Yeah, so he heals twice there. That's okay, though. Didn't heal his sword. That's a big lock. Okay. Um, we can break that. We can break that. We have boost. We can... We, we got this. Let's go ahead and use... Perfect. And then we just need the one boost from Zael. 162. We have two combo points. The sword is already back, but that's okay. Uh, we can soon. Nope, not mending light. We can soon rang again here. We will take the hit, of course, from the sword after this, but. Two ninety six. Not bad. Got the block on the sword attack and on the fist. Oh, my gosh. And Valir is missing... Oh my, she needs one MP to be able to... Shoot. She needs one MP to be able to... Okay, I guess we'll just sunball the sword and hope that that... Good. Sword's gone. Thunder. Oh my god, got that! Let's go! Alright, I think we just need a normal attack here. Get some MP back, get more boost. And, oh my gosh. That is just a one shot if it goes, if I miss the timing. No pressure. Um, we can get that boost. And, yes, let's get that boost and then a free sunball. It's a lot of damage. 312. Moonerang. Yeah, I think we just Moonerang. I don't think Lunar Shield is the call here, just because of the Counter Strike from the sword, right? If it comes back. So I just don't think we use it. Yeah, it's not worth. We just get the timings and we'll be fine. Big damage, 356, let's go. And, oh my gosh, blocked. Uh, MP is looking real bad. We do have Solstice Strike though, so let's use it, get some MP back. Again, I, I think maybe I should save it for block breaking, but... 
feel like with these relics, we just gotta play offensive. Countered, unfortunately missed the block, so we take the three damage. I got that one, though. Let's go. See, this is what I mean. Right here, we'd be able to break it. So he's gonna heal himself. Oh, oh, I missed the block again. Oh, no. He's gonna heal himself. Uh, luckily, he doesn't actually heal the sword. Moonarang from Valir. Oh, this might actually kill me, though. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Sorry, Zale. Oh, my gosh. At least I got the timing on that one. Didn't screw it up again. Uh, we could use a heal. No, we don't want to ultimate because of the lock. Obviously, the way the art for art, artful relic works, we'll just, yeah, we'll just get it back up. Uh, we can boost here. I have no MP on Valir, but... Hmm. If we... I have one healing item. Um, if we use... I think we just boost. So we won't be able to break this lock. Right? But we'll at least be able to... Valir's so close to going down herself. Yeah, we'll just heal. Just use it. Now, no healing items left. Um, we're going to boost here and then just attack, and we should be... If we dash strike here, we can actually get rid of the sword and at least make the lock weaker. That's 140. Oh, that didn't get rid of the sword. Oh, no. That's fine. We're all right. We're all right. For Blado, this is probably going to kill. Oh, oh, my God, I got it. All right, we're getting him low. It's not looking too good for him. He's got two turns here. I think we... I kind of want to say we soon rang. Uh, how much? Okay, I think we soon rang here. And then we use Zale's... We use Zale's ultimate. Come on, man. Ultimate. Let's go. Come on, Zale. Solid's light salvation. Finish up the Elder Mist with the Artful Gambit equipped. Let's go, dude. Come on, take him out. Yes, let's go. Elder Dist with the Artful Gambit on. Oh, 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 oh. Strong you are indeed. May these serve you well. We got the Sunblade and the moon bow. Godspeed, Solid and Luana. But that's not our names. Oh my god, we did it! Oh, that was dope. The legendary sword of the guardian god, Solin. Plus 10 attack, plus 6 magic attack. Let's let us go. <laughs> that was dope. And the legendary staff of the guardian goddess Luana. Plus 14 attack, plus 5 magic attack. Let us go! We're the best. Oh, that was awesome, dude. So this is the build we use. Leeching Thorn and Moonstone Bracer for Valir. And then uh, the Heliacal Earrings and the Solstice Sash for Zale. Damn! That was awesome. That was so cool. And, of course, for the relics we had on, we had, uh, you know, normal ones. But then we also had six cents, which I definitely recommend having if you're going to be rocking. No, I mean, besides bragging rights, there's no reason not to. And um, we also had double edge and artful gambit on as well. 
uh, for that boss fight, which is amazing, and we did it. So that is all of the Solstice Shrines done. The best weapons in the game now for Zale, Valir, and Sarai from the Gun Goddess, which we also beat with the, with the, uh, what's it called, on apps amazing. Let's beat up this guy just for fun, huh? See ya. Just to feel, just to feel strong. We're also almost level 20. There you go, y'all. We did it. Woo! That was awesome! And my friends, we're back on the world map, and I think for now, if we actually, if we open the camp, I think that's probably going to be it for this side quest episode. Uh, if we check with Valir, she mentioned the Solstice Shrine. She might say something. I'm ready. She's she's ready. I mean, yeah, we are. We got the best. We saved Sarai. Uh, we don't have any stories with Teeks right now, but we do know that Rashan is pointing. Uh, Rashan's puppet, I should say, is pointing at that place on the map. And we also have uh, Bist that wants to go compete in the arena in, in Brisk. So in the next episode of Sea of Stars, we're going to finish up whatever side quest cleanup, world cleanup we have left. So the next one might end up being a big episode. We'll see. Thank you so much for watching. And remember, never give up, never surrender to the artful gambit. Relic. That thing's crazy. Also, uh, don't forget likes and comments and all that stuff really helps me out. Thanks, you're beautiful. Smooches. But wait, there's more. No! Oh no! Ah! Almost had him. That and then. Oh, I missed the block! <laughs> oh, I wasn't paying attention. Oh my god. <sighs> All right, one more, one more, one more. I need a coffee. Ah, 